Right, it's a possibility this is the turn-in. I really can't remember, but we'll go this way anyway, but it might take me down to Ladies Coombe. I hope not. Something tells me this I'm on the right track, but I really, really can't remember till I get round the corner where I can see the the vallums and the ridges. Then I'll know. But uh, it's a very defined track, this one, so I would say that I wouldn't need, wouldn't be wanting to go further over that way. Do you see what I mean? Well, I can see the hill fort now. I can see the outline. What I've never done before is walk round, round it that way. I said I would do that. Yeah, see there's ways down. We don't go that we don't go down there. I don't reckon so. I can't tell the truth, I can't really remember. So I'm just gonna follow this path, I think. I don't know, I don't know. I could get lost yet. I can see a track going up around there, I think this is it. You can then decide whether you want to walk right round it. Which I don't know if I'm going to do today because I've got to be careful with time still. I spent a bit of time on that Trendle Hill, you see. Isn't it gorgeous so everyone? And the last time I came here as well, I saw a stag. A very young stag. And he stayed still for ages. I said hello to him. He let me take his photo. <sighs> yeah, this is where you have to make a decision, Chill. Here. This is the hill fort. You usually come that way. That takes you around it. What do you want to do? I don't know. Well, I tell you, go up here. You can always go back around the other way and see if all the time's like when you get there. You need to stop in a minute and um, get your coat off, all right? And have a drink of water. What should I do in a sack? So here we are. This is Downsborough Hill Fort, everyone. I and AJ Hill Fort. And normally I come down. I've always come down. Just seen a great big sparrow hawk flew past me then. There, there is a track going round that way, but because I, I need to check the time and I'll get up here and I might just go back round so far and then back. I might. When I've seen the time. Because we are a long way from Big Noller. We're that big hill I took pictures of in the distance. We're on it. We're on it. Let's just put the camera up there a minute. Oh, no, it won't. It won't settle there. Wait a minute. I'm carrying my scarf. I've got a hat in my pocket. It's a little bit of a hill. See this hill fort, they haven't condemned the trees. They haven't said that these trees are damaging this hill fort. It 
See, there are other ways up to the top. Like up there, see? Me being breathless all the time. I'm not going to do it today. I keep meaning to do it. I mean, when I had Alberta, I could have parked her down the road there, see? In a minute, I just want to take my coat off. Drink of water. I'm finding, looking for somewhere I can prop my camera up. Without getting it attacked by ticks. Yo, yeah, if you reckon it was down there I saw that stag. Um, it was only a young one. I got him on video. I've just seen a little ledge. Wait a minute. Just gonna put the camera there a minute. Well, I, Sheila, can I sort myself out? First thing, drink of water. I can see a tick from here. Charging up this. Alright, wait a minute. I've got my bum bag, I'll carry the camera in for protect it protects it takes the weight off me as well takes the weight off I just want to put my scarf away stuff on it. Put my scarf away. Won't need it later you see once we get hopefully I won't need um I've got all my pack lunch in there look see the pack lunch in there what am I gonna get out? Get an orange out now An orange. I'm keeping some for when I get to Holford. Piece of cake. I've got cheese, tomatoes, chocolate. Um, got my hat. Hat. <laughs> I'll fold the bag up. Right. Hold the coat up, like this. Might need to put it on again. Roll it up. Then it fits under here. And just tighten it up. See? Put the bum bag back on. Put that round my neck so the camera doesn't fall on the floor. Charger. Put that up. Oh, I know what I forgot to do. Check the time. Do 
check the time, which we don't like doing. 20 past 12, we've got we're in good target time. Very good. 20 past 12, we've got to the fort. It's taken, it's taken me four hours, but I've, done, I've been doing other things. It's taken four hours to get here. So you've got to think it's going to take four hours to get back via Holford. But it is downhill and then a bit uphill. Next drink I have is going to be my fruit juice treat. My fruit juice treat. Let's put that in properly because you lose it here. Push it in tight. You don't want to lose water when you're out here. Now, I'm going to pick the camera up and hope no ticks have got on it. That's it. Right, folks, so we're going, carrying on with a walk. No sign of a tick on the camera. So I just, I do that now and again so people know it, I'm real. And I do actually go out and I do get to these places. Gorgeous, isn't it? I remember now, I know where I am. I reckon that takes you down into Ladies Coombe. Definite now. Well, like I said, it's several years since I've been here, so. And I was coming from the other, opposite direction. It's a different perspective. Right, over and out, I'm going to turn, not turn the camera off, I just want to turn the video off, take some photos. Carrying on the video, this hill fort sticks out for miles. On a good day, from, from Western, from some point in Western, I can see this hill fort in the distance. It's when you haven't got brain down in the way, I mean. It sticks out, this big, big hill fort. You can see some sheep down there. Right down there. Oh, I'm glad I got some shots of that. Um, fall and... Uh, and yeah, the stallion was protecting them. He was shaking his head at me, shaking his head at me, as if to say, keep away, keep away. I did. I kept away. So I expect to get a lot of visitors. Well, of course they do. Loads of people are up there all the time. You're not really supposed to feed the horses, though, because they can get wind, trapped wind and things like that. A lovely, 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 lovely places. Now here we come to a point where I go down towards Holford, or you can carry on round. I don't know if I'll bother because basically it's all just going to be trees like I've just seen. But what I'll do, I would to compromise. I'll do a little bit that way. I'm not going all the way round again. I don't want to do that. And I don't want to go too far because I've got to come back. But we'll just have a look up here a minute. And look at this view. Look at this view. I've got to go down there. All the way over to there I've got to go. In a minute. There's the coom. That's some Holford coom. And further over you'll have Hodder's coom and Ladies, Ladies Edge. Shepherd's Coombe. Not very good day for distance. Steep home is just very, very misty in the in the distance. There's two people walking down there. And I'll be going down there in a minute. But what I'm gonna do Hold on that which bit goes round then? I think I I probably have to go around there in a minute. 
what I'm going to do, I just walk a little couple hundred yards this way, just out of interest. I'm keeping Sony running because Sony, like I said, you turn it off, it won't always come on. It was very good the other day. It came back on. I'm only going to do a little bit up here, which I've never done before. Or if I have, I can't remember it. Because I did some early walks a few years back. Oh, it looks like someone's just dumped a load of stuff out here, doesn't it? Concrete and everything. See, here's one of the vellums. They might have done it, the history people, the archaeologists, to strengthen this vallum. This is the vallums. This is part of the hill fort. This is quite a good example here. If I hadn't climbed up here, I wouldn't have seen this. They're on the other side. So we just do a little bit more. Yeah, this is like... um where the palisade would be built up. A wooden palisade. Probably much, much higher, don't forget. They used to have them very high. And of course, you know, it wouldn't be easy to run up the side of this place, would it? In fact, the trees act as obstacles, don't they? Right, now all I can see from here, is going down here, is I go to the bottom and I would just come back round again. Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to have a compromise. I'm going to just go up a little bit up there, about another 100 yards, and I'm turning back. Because basically I'll just be going round and ending up where I've, where I've just walked. But this must be the top round here. This must be the top. I'm going to that wider space and then I'm going to turn back. Yeah, I would say this was... I'm on the top of the hill for... I think I am. I reckon this is the top. About here. Feels like the top here, doesn't it? Is this going back down again? There's nothing to mark. They don't seem to put any plaques up or anything. And no way... You have to go online. So I would say this is the top of the hill foot I'm on. That would just take me back round. I mean, it is, I, I am a curious person. And I would want to know where it went. So, take note of this. If I come out again, I've got to come down this way and go round. <sighs> okay, hill foot, I've got to go back now. There's a long walk ahead of me yet. I'll take some more pictures.